Let's visualize pressure contours in a plane cutting through the blade. First we have to create the plane. I'll say location plane. I'll leave the default name and let me so I need it need a YZ plane and I will pick X to be minus 10 and you will see shortly where that location is and say apply and you will see the um, the plane being you know the plane that cuts through the blade and you can rotate it using the middle mouse button this is a little bit easier to see without the um, without the the three blades so I'll go to fluent over here and look at only the single blade that we have in the simulation. Then I'll come back here and I'll say I want to look along X so I'll click on X and I'll zoom in here using the right mouse button. I will turn off the blade so uh, or the pressure contours over here and I can play with these bounds over here. So if I double click on plane and enable plane bounds and let's say 20 and 20 for the bounds of the plane and apply. So, you know, the bounds basically give you that. Um, and so this is, you know, the jaggedness is because it's cutting through the mesh. Next, we will visualize the pressure contours on this plane. I'll go click on contour and I'll give it a name saying pressure contours on plane. OK. And the location is going to be the plane that I just created. And let me say the number of contours is 101 and apply. And here it's showing me, you know, it's, it's scaling this to the range, the, the global range of pressures. Let's change that, you know, the range of pressures plotted to just the range of pressures in the plane. So I can do that by changing the range from global to local and say apply. So I'm getting a much tighter range here and that brings out the, um, the pressure distribution in the, around the airfoil a little bit better. And if I zoom in using the right mouse button and I say escape to get rid of that red dot, Okay, um, I can zoom in so I can see where the, uh, let me actually do that. So I can see where the high pressures are and where the low pressures are. 